Beckett to Task Force One. Approaching confirmed target. Keep all radio contact on this frequency. We don't want any slip-ups this time. Task Force One, Commander to Beckett. Reading you clear and awaiting further instructions. Okay, listen up, guys. Target buildings in the west quadrant. Number of suspects unknown. Expect maximum resistance. We'll be right behind you, Beckett. Oh, yeah? We'll try and keep up, guys. It's only a girl driving. <laughs> hey, Alex. You are it. But as long as I keep looking ahead. Don't worry. Get used to Rosal's driving eventually. This is the gun runner who evaded you. Eric Hammer. We were this close to shutting him down for good. Yes. But instead, he cleared out. Just in time. What a lucky man. Well, he must have known about our raid. Someone's certainly been helping him. As far as we know, he's made four successful attempts on government weapons dumps in as many months. And suddenly it's our problem. Well, when SSD can get to the bottom of it, where else could we turn? I promised the minister personally you'd get results. Oh, great. So now we've got to catch a mole as well as Hammer. Hmm. What happened to that computer disk you recovered from Hammer's base? Roz is working on it right now. I don't believe it. Could it be? Yes, I think it's true. Ladies and gentlemen, a first Ros Henderson beaten by a computer code. Ed, shut up. Hold on, I'm trying to concentrate. Ros, it's for you. Yeah, well, not now, Alex. Take a message. I'm sorry, Channing. She's busy just now.
Roz, I thought any code could be broken. Mm, it can. It's just a question of computer power and time. I'm running a randomized cracking sequence now. Well, maybe the clues on the disk label. May I? Yeah, be my guest. Thanks. BJL1215. <laughs> Meaning of life? 12.15. Is it a time? Can I see that? Sure. It's an ordinary disk. It's just the encryption is so tough. Two keys, 70 characters each. I could be here forever. How long? On this computer, I'm not kidding, 25 years. We've got to find another way in. Who are you? Reinhold. Good morning, Director. The cream of the special services department. We were just talking about you. Who's your friend? Davis, Carla, SSD field agent, grade five, sir. Well, I'm pleased to hear you know your place. So, uh, what can we do for you? Director, we have orders to search the bureau offices and to impound any materials that we think fit. Can you stop what you're doing and move away from the workstation? The director of SSD has clearly exceeded his remit. Yes, I am criticizing your department, Minister. Hey, that's my lunch. I thought I was going to buy you lunch today. You hadn't forgotten? Huh. Well, that's all right, then. What are the sandwiches for, insurance? Excuse me. Yes, but I must... Be careful with that. I must register my disquiet. Well, I hardly think a minute at the next Joint Intelligence Committee is sufficient. He is taking my hard drive. What is going on? The director of SSD has gone over my head. He's cleared all this with the Home Office. Cleared it? Cleared what? SSD thinks there's some kind of leak from the Bureau. What? Because of your backgrounds, because of your semi-freelance status. Coupled with your failure to arrest Hammer last night, a lot of people in high places seem to believe them. It's all nonsense. It's all insulting nonsense. Look, it's cock-up, not conspiracy. Someone's just misread a code or there's a typing error in a memo. I mean, it'll all be sorted out before lunch. Well, I'm not going to hang around here and watch these clowns pull everything apart. It is exactly this kind of Whitehall infighting that made me wary of this setup in the first place. Should anybody need me, I'll be at home. Here. I'm going to take care of this. Anderson, I'm afraid I can't Get out of my leave. way. I'm sorry. Get out I of my I way. I'm sick and tired of you people what? have walked in here. What is going on? My here? orders are to let no one leave, Director. Then I'm overruling your orders. Let Miss Henderson go. Channing Hardy, please. Or will he be out of the meeting? No, thanks. I'll pull back. It must have something to do with the disc. I mean, you were working on it. You can decode it. It's your place they've smashed up. Reinhold and Davis were looking for the disc. Well, I mean, it, it must be. They must have come here first when they couldn't find it. They came onto the office. But it's supposed to be on our side. Why didn't they just ask? Yeah, well... Perhaps if we knew what was on it, we could answer that question. True. But if it's that dangerous, I think we should put it on ice for a while, yeah? Good idea. Give me an hour. I'll hide it and see you back at the bureau. OK. Now, look, do you want me to help you? <laughs> I'll be fine. You sure? Nick? Thanks.
Uh, 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 Channing Hardy, please. Don't tell me that again. Just get him out of the meeting and bring him to the phone now. Do you understand? What about Italy? Whatever. It's your honeymoon too, you know. You could at least take an interest. I do. She's back. Just the two people I wanted Under to see. Under section three, paragraph 26 of the government. Well, like, oh! You're charged with prescribed behaviour within the meaning of the act. Do you have anything to say at this point? Have you gone out of your mind? Get off of Ms. me! Mr. Henderson, I'm suspending you from all bureau duties and placing you in custody, effective oh. immediately. This is supposed to show Roz being bribed by Hammer himself. You said someone must have tipped him off. Yeah, but not Roz. So explain this. Oh, come on, Jen, don't be dense. These are fakes. Beckett! I know you're emotionally involved here, but being rude to me won't help Roz. Look at these. All baloney. Anyone can fake video or stills these days. Not anyone, Beckett. It takes a lot of skill and very expensive equipment. Hang on a minute. Are you telling me that you think Roz is guilty? Look. There are plenty within the establishment who don't like what I'm doing with the Bureau. People who think you're dangerous freebooters. People who would love to close you down. But there's more to this than that. I mean, they haven't attacked you or me, have they? No, they targeted Rob. Right, so it's got something to do with the disc. If we can decode it, we can find out why Hammer had it. So decode it. Oh, yes. Well, unfortunately, there's only one person I know who can. Last. Where am I? Come with me. So what is this place, then? Hello? What is going on? Who do you work for? Who's in charge here? Look! Just give me some answers. That's what we want from you. Bring her in. Sit down. It's Carla, isn't it? Please. Who are you tell working you. for? What? I said, who are you working for? You know who I work for. This will be much easier if you try and cooperate. I work for the Bureau. How long have you been working for foreign interests? I'm sorry? Tell me about 1980. What about it? <laughs> 12th of August, 1980. You were cautioned by the police for illegal use of electricity. Phone freaking, I believe you'd call it. <laughs> Making calls without pay. Oh, please, kid stuff. And what I... about the mysterious disappearance of nine penalty points from your driving licence in 1984? That was a hacker's bed. I was at you. How do you know this? We know everything about you. I don't care what the regulations say. If I don't see Ros Henderson in the next five minutes, I'm going to take that damn rule book of yours and I'm going to shut... Diplomacy, remember? That was me being diplomatic. Oh. Do you know who I am? I am Director of Intelligence Coordination, not some lowlife off the street. I have Level 7 security clearance. But in the case of an SSD operational matter, I have autonomy and total authority, even over a superior officer with Level 7 clearance. You do realise this whole situation is a terrible mistake? That's exactly what Henderson's saying. Ros was framed. She's not a traitor. Who knows? But unless Henderson starts to cooperate, we can't hope to get to the truth. If we could speak with her, 
Perhaps we could persuade her of the logic of your argument. I don't think that's a good idea right now. I want to see Roz now. She's sleeping. Right, well, I'll wait until she wakes up, shall I? I'm afraid I can't allow that. But as soon as she wakes, I'll call you. Now, if you'll excuse me. I thought you outranked him. It's a little more complicated than that. Roz is not guilty. I know. But the best thing you can do to help her is to find the real mole. What was your involvement with Roland Blatty? Roland? You were at university together, you worked with him at the Bureau, and you were present when he died. Just a coincidence? How dare you? Roland Blatty was my friend. Jean Daniel ah, yes, murdered... Jean Daniel, so-called a master criminal. His body was never found. Yeah, well, believe me, he's dead. You visited him in prison, I understand. Unusually friendly of you. What is this? Look, if you had read that file properly, you know what Beckett, Ed and I have achieved. What exactly am I supposed to have done? Gun running. <laughs> You've been stealing weapons from government stores to supply terrorists. Yeah, right. You are joking. This is not a joke. How long have you worked for Eric Hammer? What I did you work approach for... Hammer or did he seek? I have out? never met the man. I've got videotape upstairs <laughs> showing you taking the money. Then from it's him a on three fake. Separate... Some things can't be fake. <laughs> Don't you believe it? Look, I have had enough of this. I want to see your superior. You will see I want to see who's in charge. You can't do this. Whatever I want to get results. Now don't make me angry and you won't get hurt. Sit down. That's enough, Davis. I'll take over. Sir? I'm sorry if Davis got carried away. That occasional burst of temper is one of her very few failings. Of course, uh, I'm biased. You see, Carla and I are getting married. <laughs> I don't care if you're Anthony and Cleopatra. Get me out of here! We're not like the police. We can keep you here as long as we like. In fact, we work completely outside the law. We have nothing to do with the courts. Good start, Davis. Thank you, sir. Employees who make mistakes. <laughs> But you're the one making the mistake, not me. I haven't done anything wrong. Just tell us what we want. <laughs> it's the only way to make it stop. Now tell us more about your relationship with Roland Blatt. <laughs> Ed, calm down. Panicking's not going to help Ross. I'm not panicking, I'm just trying to think. And this is madness arresting Roz. All that false evidence. I mean, there's got to be something we can do. Maybe if we could finish what she started with that disc. Roz admitted herself it's going to take like 25 years to crack. I mean, yeah, really. OK, so, well, how is it labelled? Uh, handwritten, labelled, in green. Right. What exactly was on it? Um, uh, a code, uh, numbers, I don't know. Uh, OK, something like... This? No, it's thinner than that. Yeah, I like that. BJL, those were the letters. Well, how do you know? Well, Billie Jean, uh, <sighs> Billie Jean something or other. She, she was my first girlfriend. You've forgotten her name? Yeah, but not the initials, BJL. I wrote I love BJL all over town. There was a number as well. No, I don't. I am hopeless with numbers. It was a time. Time? Uh, ten to four, half six. Quarter past twelve. Twelve fifteen. Twelve fifteen? BJ or twelve fifteen, that's it, but... So what? We know about the label, we don't know about the really important stuff, which is the data. Okay. So we trawl through every database we've got looking for any reference to those initials. Where did you get this? The pen. Stationery cupboard. Let's take this from the top, shall we? 
Hammer's made four raids on weapons dumps in the last year. Someone thought SSD wasn't trying hard enough, so responsibility for them was switched to the Bureau. Very convenient for you. How did you swing it? We didn't ask for that brief. We were given it. And anyway, we were supposed to pick up Hammer last night. But you tipped him off just in time. <sighs> no, that is ridiculous. Only Hammer foolishly left something behind, didn't he? Yes, the computer disk. At last. Knew you'd get there in the end. Is that what all this has been about, the disk? Why didn't you just ask for it? And what's on it? The evidence against you. If you hadn't picked it up, it would have unmasked you immediately. I nearly got blown to Kingdom Come retrieving that. So I heard. Excellent performance. Where is it, Miss Henderson? We've suspected for some time there's a mole in the security services. Now we know who it is. And when we prove it, you're going to spend the rest of your life locked up. Cracked it? I certainly have. Oh. But I was thinking, seeing as lunch was cancelled and we've missed dinner, we could do breakfast in a couple of hours. Well, that's a bit forward for a first date, isn't it? How are you doing with those BJLs? Oh, I've got one. Beresford Jardine Limited. They make computer security systems. Hey. Hey, get on with that tape. I've got a bike waiting to take you straight over to Jan. OK, they used a shot lifted from a security camera outside the Bureau building. Now, here's the original. Yeah, but that's in black and white. Yeah. They regraded the shot, motion tracked it, composited it into an empty shot of Hammer. Look at that. It's pretty classy stuff. Yeah. Way too technical for your average cramp. Yeah, but not for the security services. What about that database search? Oh, we may have got a lead. Well, we'll get over there. Wake up the MD if you have to. Get up. Question time. What do you know of a device called Sacros? Never heard of it. Strange. Your boss Beckett lost his job over it. But oh um, yeah, but that was ages ago. Just over two years. Sacros was stolen from the top secret listening agency, the Hive. It was eventually reported. I think we may have to try something a little more subtle. Hmm? Yeah, that's right. I turned it into a white dove. What really happened to the stolen dervish plane? It blew up. And what really happened to the criminal Jean Dernier? I am not guilty, and you're going to believe me. Carla, please. You're an intelligent woman. Someone is using you. Someone who wants that disc. Someone here at SSD. And it is not me. We thought you did computerised security systems. We do. We started off as locksmiths. It's all gone electronic now. Uh, oh. BJL contract 1215. Thank you. <sighs> uh, this is a contract to supply locks to Her Majesty's Dockyard, Chatham. 4th of May, 1821. We've been government contractors for centuries. Right. Sorry to have gotten you out of bed, sir. Um, what was the number of that contract? 1215. We could try the second series contracts. You see, when they reached the number 999999, the contracts department started again at 0000. Oh. Come with me.
It's odd. There's one missing. 12.14, 12.16. I guess we're on the right track. Thank you, sir. Gage wants results quickly. He's doing it his way. Miss Henderson? Miss Henderson? Answer. You wanted her to escape. So she'd lead us to that disc. Well, where's the bug? In her shoe. If I hadn't been expecting that blow, I think she might have taken my head off. Thank you, Director. Hey, any news of Ross? Uh, Jen's doing what she can, but it's taking too much time. Best thing we can do for Ross is to find that real traitor. We struck lucky at BJL. Yeah? Yeah, contract 1215. It's for security systems at government arms dumps. That's how Hammer and he's made on the inside. We're able to march straight into arms dumps, RS-1 and SL-19. And G-10 and PR-4. Yeah, all right, I get the picture, but he won't be raiding any more arms dumps without that disc. He'll be desperate to get the disc back. It's interesting, isn't it? Only a couple of hours after Ross discovers the disc, SSD are ransacking her apartment. And then they came here. The mole's in SSD. She's 50 metres north of my position. Check. I can't see her. Get closer. Hold on. Have you got her? Can you see her? Is it her? No. She's got to be close. Are you okay? I've been so worried. My feet hurt. I am. Um... I need to phone the bureau. Of course. Jenny, did you try and ring me yesterday? Yes, it can wait. How did she sound? Uh, tired. No surprise. What is this place? This place. This place is Ros's new home. Oh. I didn't realize she found somewhere so quickly. Yeah, well, she's, um. I've actually been living here for the last couple of weeks or so. <laughs> this is Channing's house. Yeah, well, she, uh, she didn't want you to know. Well, come on, look on the bright side. If you didn't know she was here, SSD couldn't possibly know, eh? I think she's had somewhere safe to run to. Thank you. 
Sir. Sir, I think I have a lead. Ross called Channing. It was among her things removed from the Bureau. And? Miss Henderson has a sideline marketing her inventions, a business run by one Channing Hardy. Good work, Nevis. Gotcha. Channing, this is uh, very civilized. There we go. Well, the disc was here all the time. If you want to hide a tree, go to a forest. Milk everyone? Yes, please. Uh, Channing, are there any biscuits, have you? Yes, certainly. Thank you. These BJL discs contain a security feature which can help us. When it's read, it takes a record of the user. Really? So once I've decoded it, which I can, all will be revealed. Except, of course, I don't have the right equipment here. Will you tell me what you need and I'll get it for you? Great. Here we are. Oh, we've got to go. Thank you. SSD. Ed, you get Ros out of here. Kenny, you're with me. Doing what? Welcoming your visitors. You've got a helicopter standing by. I'd say we're trapped on a roof. Like me, trapped on a roof? Oh, don't be silly. Find her! Now, the secret is, Roz, don't look down. Ed, the secret is stairs. <laughs> Easy does it, Roz. Nice one. Nothing. So get on the roof. Just find her. Carry on up. Looking good. Yeah, right. I'll tell you one thing, the bumper book of codes for boys was never quite like this. Yeah, well, things have moved on a bit since substitution codes. How you doing? Well, now that we've got the correct encryption algorithm from BJL, it's just a question of time. Minutes? Hours? Days? <laughs> Ten minutes at the most. Then we'll know where the next target is and who the real truth is. I was worried about you. You shouldn't have come. I wasn't followed. I wouldn't be too sure about that. SSD may be dim, but they're not stupid. 
Hello, hello. hello. You've been bugged, mate. They could be here any moment. We've got to get you out of here. No, I am so close to cracking that code, I need ten minutes at the most. If they're following my signal, why don't I drive around and leave them on a wild goose chase? Let me, Ros, for you. Ed, go with him. And leave you here. Oh, you'll be the ones in danger. They won't know where I am. Take care, Ros. Yes, take care. He should be with you very soon. Let me know when you make visual contact. I see him. I can see two of them. Both men. There's no sign of Henderson. It's like I thought, Doug. She fooled us with the shoe. Now he's fooled us too. I'm going back to the position where the car stopped. Meet me there. installation accessed as indicated. Still to be accessed, JS6. JS6? Come on, come on, speak to me. Security profile, JS6. Category, alpha restricted. Status, impenetrable. Lethal slalom defense operational. Time lapse from unauthorized entry to destruction, 20 seconds. So, now tell me who's behind this. Well done, Miss Henderson. I knew you'd get there eventually. That's why I had to try and get you out of the way. You're the one's been working with the arms dealer all this time. A sideline that was providing a perfect retirement fund. Which is about to pay out with one final massive clearance sale and this. This is your master key to the arms dumps. Correct. We've saved the best to last. The JS-60, that's the plum, where all the really nasty stuff is stored. Have you been there long? Long enough, sir. That's a shame. Oh, dear. Now you've committed murder. No one will believe you. People believe anything of the dead. Sir? I couldn't stop her. She killed Reinhold. Doug? I'm sorry. Davis, I want all sightings of Ross Henderson reported directly to me. Ross? Beckett, Beckett, it's Gage. He's the mole. And he's killed Reinhold. Oh, listen to me. Gage got the disc back. He and Hammer are planning to use it to clear up arms dump JS6. One final massive haul. Well, look, give us your position. We'll pick you up. I can't, but Davis is onto me. I gotta go. Ross, Ross.
our sort of partner, to kill her. Think I don't know that already. Impenetrable slalom defense, eh? Slalom defense activated. Destruction in 20 seconds. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. System overridden. Shut down. Shut down. System overridden. Shut down. Nearly finished. Last slide. Careful! Look, dropping things is becoming a habit with you. It's Gage. We've nearly finished, yeah. You should have everything you need, plus a few surprises. Uh -uh, it's getting too dangerous here. I'll be gone by tomorrow. Well, you just have to find someone else. Yes, that's what we agreed. Make sure it's in the account. Yeah, by twenty three hundred dollars our time. Gage! I'm Mr. Hammer. She's got a grenade! Quiet! See where your carelessness has got us. Luckily, it's an empty threat. Miss Henderson would never do it. Really? Right now, I'm wanted for theft, murder, and treason. I have nothing to lose, but you, Gage, you don't want to die. There's no danger of me dying. Is there, Davis? Put the pin back, Henderson, and get down. The pin! What's going on here, sir? Oh, wake up, Carla. Why is the director of SSD doing field work? He's the traitor, not me. Sir? Davis, don't throw away your career. She's lying. Carla, I watched him kill your fiance. Why did the search order come direct from you, sir? Carla! Stay there! Get that truck out of here. Are you all right? Now do you see? The security system's been deactivated. Pity it's not a security system it's possible to drive through. Gage and Hammer must be here already. Let's split up. You find Gage, we'll deal with Hammer. Take care. See that you and Rhino both get posthumous awards. Go, go! If I stay here, you're gonna be all right. I'm fine. I'm ready for help. Your help. And there is one other thing I need to talk to you about. Yes. Well, the security in this place, I mean, it's not very, very secure, is it? Well, ain't that the truth? It's got more holes than a sieve. What it needs, of course, is a complete overhaul. I could do that, you know, tomorrow or something. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> Isn't it great to have her back?
Back to normal. As normal as it ever gets. Thank you. I don't think I realize quite what your work with the Bureau entailed. Now you do. Don't you ever get fed up being shot at, chased, tied up? Yes, I do. But it's my day job. Doesn't have to be. What does that mean? I've been doing some thinking. Maybe you should make some changes to your lifestyle. <laughs> what sort of changes? Channing? I'm merging with an American company. This is our new corporate base in California. You're moving to the States? Yes, I'll have to. I rather thought... Good, I'm glad you rather thought. I'll need someone special to head up the research division. I'd love it to be you. <laughs> 